today is a big day. Um, we are transporting one of our female red wolves um, to the Roger Williams Zoo in Rhode Island. And we are receiving um, a mail from the Wolf Conservation Center. So it's really, really exciting. It's this wonderful volunteer program called Light Hawk. And it's a group of volunteer pilots that spend their time, their free time, transporting endangered species to different SSPs. So it's a really, really cool program. And we're really excited to be a part of it. Um, an SSP is a species survival plan. And there are several um, facilities around the country that house a laundry list of different endangered species. Um, we are fortunate enough to house both Mexican gray wolves and red wolves, and we're very, very excited to um, be, be a part of that and have uh, reproductive pairs of those, both of those species on site. The red wolves are a very critically endangered species. Um, in the 70s, there were only 14 left in the world. Um, their, their population is continuing to dwindle. They're native to a really small part of North Carolina. Unfortunately, they are still not doing well. So we are going to go get our hands on the one female. We have our microchip reader, everything. We know who she is. Um, and we're going to anesthetize her. They're superstar wolf gravity pants. <laughs> <laughs> She's in the hole. So as we suspected, this girl um, went in a hole. Not a big deal. I crawled in there. It wasn't a very big hole. I've been in far scarier. She's got an incredible core. Look at those muscles. She's drinking, moving, pulling. I crawled in, I anesthetized her. It was very, very textbook. She went down like she was supposed to. I put the head cover on her, pulled her out, and uh, we took her in for a health check. We're gonna do a blood sample and get her, check all of her parasite meds, make sure that's all up to date, give her antibiotics and give her um, her vaccines. And then we will put her in a crate was very, very by the book. Roberta and Betsy and I will drive to the, I think it's the Osceola Airport. <laughs> oh, I get the plane. Um, so we're here at the airport and we're going to do the exchange with the male red wolf for the female red wolf. Um, we're just totally geeking out over how cool the plane is. So it, it's just, it's amazing that they do this. A wolf. I thought you said a wolf. Yeah. <laughs> he's, he's I hope he's still smiling. It was a smooth trip. He oh <laughs> didn't need much, uh, not, need much of my attention. Hi, buddy. So what's the plan for this, this guy? Uh, so this guy actually, um, the female that we have, is the sister to what will be his new mate. Uh -huh. So she was taken away from her sister and he will be given to her. So there's kind of a swap ah. that we're doing. Hopefully next yeah. year they'll have pups. So, so happy to be a volunteer yeah. pilot. Yeah. 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 Such a great organization. Such nice people that work for Lighthawk and it's just, it's, it's, it's an incredible group and it was an amazing thing to see and it's just really awesome. So we're back from the airport with this new beautiful boy. Um, we're very excited. We're going to introduce him to his new lady friend, but um, I really doubt that they'll interact with each other tonight. Uh, we have two deer in there that are on opposite ends of their world, so they don't have to talk to each other. They can eat and just acknowledge each other from very far away. Um, I think it will be a very slow process, but uh, I'm excited for them. They, they did a very good job of making sure that the store was secure. So. We're just doing the exact same thing that they're going to have to do with our crate um, to let this guy out. So that went about as smooth as you could hope for. They sniffed each other and went around their merry way, no aggression. Um, he's just, he's a really cool looking wolf. He looks like an old male we used to have here. Um, it's really exciting to have him have him here and have them together and this is just great. So we'll keep an eye on it for the next few days, but I'm not worried at all. This is awesome. <laughs>